The 2020 general election is shaping up to be a really close one. Yeah, but even election officials are preaching patience on the results and warning that we might not even know the results on November 3rd. With just one month to go until Election Day, 4 million Americans have already voted mail-in or absentee 50 times the numbers we saw one month out from the 2016 general election. And because of that, even local election officials are noting it might take longer than just November 3rd to get our final results. Please be patient when it's time for election results. In a conference call with reporters on Tuesday, Kent County Clerk Lisa Postumus lyons said the 40,000 absentee ballots Kent County has already turned in this year is creeping up on the 69,000 returned in 2016 total. My office expects a huge influx of absentee ballots this year, and that means it is going to take longer to uh, count and process those ballots. Also Tuesday, the governor, in an effort meant to speed up results, signed a bill that would let cities with 25,000 residents or more begin processing, not county, but processing ballots the day before the election. It's really a technical question in, in terms of, of when we will know for sure David Rutledge is a professor of political science at Central Michigan University. I would think that the in-person uh, votes will be counted pretty quickly. Mail in, call it absentee uh, ballots, that, that process is going to be slower. And he adds that could skew the results as the counting goes on. While you may have one winner from, from the um, in-person voting, it is highly possible that... Uh, that there would be a different outcome once all of the ballots are counted. And if that is the case, it's likely President Trump would be the candidate with the early lead since recent national surveys show that Biden voters are twice as likely to vote absentee. So now, with just under 30 days to go, political experts like Professor Rutledge and those in charge of running a smooth election are simply preaching patience. I would absolutely uh, urge patience and calm. We are not going to sacrifice security and accuracy for speed. So please be patient. And also keep in mind that the election itself isn't certified until county and state canvassers in all 50 states across the country have counted and double checked their results. And again, every year that typically isn't done until December. It's